Oh, God damn it. <laughs> I found this stuff while perusing the tubes of you guys. So, this is the first time I've tried this. I bought this stuff, I'm trying it out, and this is what I've been wanting to show you guys. This is what I'm going to use to paint the cutting cart. There's four grams in that cup there. I have four ounces of fluid I'm waiting for the aerosol to clean out of there and then I'm gonna mix it up and we're gonna start shooting stay with me guys stay with me I'm excited so I measured it out four grams of powder for four ounces of fluid and it's already changing color inside of the jar. I don't know if my camera's going to pick up my test fork. But where it's orange there is water. So it does work. So we're going to assemble our sprayer here. And we're going to go lay down some paint. I'll bring you back. I had to mix up a second batch. So I just got some of that stuff, sprayed it into the bottle with the hose, mixed in my powder, I stirred it, I mix it up real good, and you can watch it change color. It works, I'm excited, and that's just the fork, wait till you see the cart. Fork has changed colors, and the second coat of paint is gone. So it took two batches, 
two coats and I use both of my sprayer systems so I'll show you the results. One thing to note, I didn't care for this particular design, is keep this in mind. And because of that, it's got that little breather hole and as you can see it can get messy. have it. Sun hitting it nice and hard for you. It's yellow. It's definitely yellow. I wish those spray cans were a little bit bigger. I would like to get a little bit more coverage on there, but eh. I can't complain too much. No. Hoses some new chains be good to go thanks for watching guys well that's funny I was coming out here to show you guys the uh, bottle on the cart and already it's turning colors <laughs> right on that worked exactly like I wanted it to so I was going to show you my fork as well I have an, an ice cube here. Isn't that cool? Get yourself some of this stuff. It's fun to play with. Alright. This is the stuff. This is what I used. And those are the results I got. Now I'm pretty happy with it. Check it out. Let me know what you think. Try it. Show me your projects. I bet you the uh, 88 Katana could paint some really neat stuff. So if you're watching, Mr. 88 Katana, that's Kirsten 68 Barracuda. That's what the 340 is going into. You guys have seen this car before, right? Dad painted the cam member. Got the power steering for it. Still smells like a classic muscle car in here.